not fear, for it is I, Rhea Silmane. Who is Rhea Silmane? The ghost you first see in the Imperial Dungeon at the start of Arena, and the person who sends you on your quest to defeat Jagathan. Rhea is a prominent figure in the Arena questline, who guides you through collecting the eight pieces of the Staff of Chaos, and yet we know very little about her. From the game, we know that Rhea was an Imperial apprentice to the battle mage Jagathan in the year 3E389. She was one day brutally murdered by the staff of Chaos wielded by her teacher when she discovered of his treachery. She used her last bit of magic to put herself into a corporal state between life and death so she could warn the player of Tharn and free them from the dungeon to go in search of the Staff of Chaos in the hope of defeating Jagathan. What we don't know is whether Rhea knew the player when she was alive, but it is strongly likely they did know each other because they were both part of the Imperial Court. So after sp having spent many years in this arena, it's likely they would have encountered each other once or twice, but it's not known if the two of them shared a close relationship or if it was more just a first names type basis. Some players have speculated that Rhea has become a guardian type figure for the character in other Elder Scrolls games such as Skyrim. In Skyrim, Rhea is a young, brown-haired, imperial girl who is new and apprentice and who wants to aid the Dover King when they first join the Companions. However, this is only one person's opinion so it's really up to speculation is she hasn't really appeared in any of the other games. It's just a coincidence, really, that she's an Imperial apprentice and is quite young, and also called Rhea as well. Some have tried to speculate what Rhea's life was like before her death. She was generally kind, intelligent, resourceful, and a good user of magic. This is obvious in how she was able to project herself as a corporeal form to the player in the cell. And also, she is loyal to the saviour of Tamriel and put her life on the line to stop Jagathan at all costs. She is also very resourceful because she is able to recognise that the Staff of Chaos is very important and the only way to get it in some way is to collect the eight pieces. And she has knowledge of their whereabouts through an unknown source but it is likely because of her magic and her connection with her then teacher, Jagathan, who she was unfortunately betrayed by. She was at least able to, in her death, by utilising the player, have revenge against Than and bring peace to the land, because after he died, she was able to pass on to the afterlife in the year 3E399. Hope you guys enjoyed this little storytelling. I am going to be doing more of these types of videos, so if you enjoyed it, please check out my channel and subscribe if you enjoyed, and I'll see you in the next episode. Bye!